I did a video talking about this yesterday, but I just want to show this for some context to this video. Marvel's heading for 75 through 80 million opening. That's 50% lower than Captain Marvel's three-day opening. That's pathetic. The Marvel Cinematic Universe is not in a good place. For one, this movie is not something that anyone asked for. They're trying to make this some kind of Avengers-level event. It's nothing near the, the hype that that movie had. Uh, these are predominantly characters that people really don't care about. No one really cares about Miss Marvel. Uh, people used to care about Carol Danvers, but she was never an A-lister. And you could make the same argument about Iron Man, too, but Iron Man had Robert Downey Jr. For some reason, and it's funny because Brie Larson can't act, but for some reason, I don't know if it's a choice she's making or what, uh, when she gets in to the Carol Danvers role, uh, she decides to play the character with zero emotion. She's like a plank of wood. Uh, Monica Rambeau had a very, very lackluster debut in the MCU. She was a side character in Wanda's show. Nobody really cares about her either. Uh, she's She's got a nice audience in the comics, but not in the MCU. Uh, I don't think people are going to be excited to go see this. And you've got people actually begging women to go see this on Twitter. Here's an example from Magic Hands. All the women around the world that showed up for Barbie in the summer also need to show up for the Marvels. This movie has to do good, man. It has to do good. For one, that's not going to happen. Uh, Barbie is a movie that's actually made for women. <laughs> um, the Marvels is a movie that uh, they're expecting men to show up for, but they want women to show up. They're taking like a, a formula that's been like made for men, and they're trying to make that appeal to women. Uh, that's not going to happen. I've never heard a woman say, oh, my God, I loved Captain Marvel. For a lot of them say they loved the Barbie, the Barbie movie. Look at this poster, too. I mean, This just screams feminine en energy. You got like a dude showing his abs and chest. She's in a dress looking, looking hot, looking cute, you know, pink dress, pink car like this, 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 this is why this movie did so damn good with women. This women loved this movie. Uh, this movie, not so much. Like, look at the, the difference between these two posters. Uh, this, this movie, obviously trying to get women to show up to it. Uh, this movie having a little bit of an identity crisis because women don't give a shit about this movie. They liked uh, Wonder Woman, but you know, look at how Wonder Woman looks compared to this. And I mean the original Wonder Woman movie, by the way, not the shitty sequel, 1982 or 84, whatever they called it. That movie was forgettable trash. So this movie, what this is what women want. This isn't what women want. And that's why it's going to fall flat on its face. Now, to try to combat this, Marvel has decided to put out a new 30-second spot where they say that they're just like us. Uh, Captain Marvel, Photon, Miss Marvel, they're just like us. <laughs> Let's watch a little bit of this. You ready? Check this out. Hopefully, uh, maybe I shouldn't. I don't know if this movie, this video is copyright. I can play it without the sound. It's just a song that they play. Okay, look. Miss Marvel's just like you. This is what every girl's room looks like, right? And then they show Monica Rambeau dancing, Brie Larson. They've got to show this as much as they can because they know that this tank top scene is bringing boys to the yard. Uh, but check out this, like, they have Monica Rambeau dancing. She's just like you. This, I, man, I relate so much. I, re I relate so much to these characters. Wow. So that's the new trailer. Uh, this is supposed to get everybody excited because they're just like us for real. 
Uh, it's getting roasted into the ground by a lot of these people on here. That's a hard pass. This person's like, oh, she wore her own Crocs in the movie. Uh, a lot of people saying, oh, this person's getting some interview. Will this movie be good? What do they say? Uh, <laughs> oh, tickets in hand for three days. More to come. It's a guy. He's uh, cosplaying as Captain Marvel. Uh, cool. Pathetic. Trains running into each other. You could come up with, there's more people on here uh, dunking on it than they are excited for it. So it's just funny to me, people begging for this movie to get an audience and women, we need you to step it up. I don't think that's going to happen. I think this movie is going to be a massive flop and it's going to put things into perspective for Marvel. This is what Kevin Feige. This is what Kevin Feige turned the MCU into. A wine mom's dream. Anyway, that's pretty much it. Let me know what you guys think about all this in the comments. Also, if you would, please like, subscribe, share the video. Make sure you're still subscribed. Hit that notification bell. Check out my Rumble and Locals, and I'll see you on the next one. Peace. Make sure to check out my locals. There's a link in the description. It's a fun community that I'm trying to build over here. If you don't want to support me on YouTube, you can come over here. None of that money goes to YouTube. You also can just come over here for free. But if you are a supporter over here, I do plan on doing an extra live stream once a month and throwing links to the supporters so you can actually come on and have a supporter live stream with me. Also, it's a good place to catch all of my content. You don't have to worry about notifications like YouTube. They'll definitely work over here. So come check out my locals.